square with nothing colored in it, it may have a V or not, right, is a vault. And those vaults are 11 by 17, 24 by 36, 36 by 48. You've got to kind of use your judgment. Look at how many things are coming out. If you have a pipe coming in and a pipe going out and it's servicing a house, it's probably an 11 by 17. If you have an amplifier, it's probably a 24 by 36. If you see five pipes coming out of it, it's probably a bigger one. Right? Don't bring the little hook to open those up. All right, because you're not getting to them. The manhole, our standard covers are 24 inches round. Those are easy to get into. The ones out in these private lots are usually 36 inches. They weigh about 400 pounds. You will drop your nut if you're not careful with those. Matter of fact, you'll hurt yourself. They're dangerous. There's a special tool that opens them. There's a special way to open them. We'll teach you how to get them if you have to. But Is that what Garrett crushed his fingers in? That's what Garrett crushed his fingers in. It was one of those. Let it fall on him. All right? You Nearly know, took his fingers off. All right? So just common sense rules on these. You know what I mean? We don't have a lot of the, the 24 by 20. Well, we don't have a lot of the 12 by 12s because normally we don't install them. We normally have the 30, uh, the standard 3 by 3s, which are very easy, you know, it go up to your waist. No big deal. Right? But if you see it, know that you got to prepare for it. All right? Anything else on the underground? Good. So the riser. You, yep. I mean, uh, oh, this that's a pedestal. 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 That's right. Going down. Yeah, that's a vault. That's going to. So if you look here, we have you know I could actually do this and kind of do this over here. There you like go. That. Perfect. So if I were to look at this, I've got a pole with a riser on it, so I know that's where my feed is coming from. Utility right? pole. Mm -hmm. Utility pole with a riser. It's underground to a vault. From the vault, I'm going to a pedestal. From a pedestal to a lockbox, and somewhere in that building is a second lockbox. Pretty straightforward, right? Look at them, you can kind of walk around it. And by the way, there'll always be footages between. Got it? And depending on who the contractor runs, we'll tell you how accurate that is. Remember, contractors get paid by the footage, so that might say 140, it might only be. 24, you know, it might be 370 feet or you know, some weird number. Yeah. 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 Well, they're pretty, one? Or like in that one there, it says 250 yeah, they're feet. All half of they're like half the least. size. So we got paid for 220 feet, but oh well. Yeah, now, about 60. just be careful of that because yeah. you know your footages are going to be. If you run into a problem out there and you don't know exactly where something is, call Dick Safe in. They'll mark it for you. you know, so it's, it's not a big deal. All right? Any questions on the underground? Any questions on how the aerial pieces go? Aerial underground, good. So